It's going to be still a chilly afternoon, but not as cold as yesterday. Tomorrow, warmer highs in the 60s, and then we have another cold front coming through late Thursday, early Friday. This morning, we still have some clouds in play with a weak disturbance tracking north and east of us, but high pressure building in, and as that disturbance pulls away, we're going to watch those clouds move out as well. Here's a live shot this morning outside, and you can see in the distance some of those orange hues beginning to approach the horizon as we get ready for sunrise. 41 degrees at New Orleans International. Notice the feels like temperature matches the temp. We don't have a wind chill this morning with calm conditions. We do have a little patchy fog out there, so some of you may notice that on those commutes. Temperatures middle and upper 30s north, a mixture of 30s and 40s on the south shore, but still warmer compared to this time yesterday. Mid 40s by 9 o'clock and still watching that sun cloud mix and we'll see gradual clearing into afternoon highs today around the mid 50s with winds variable at times northwest 5 to 10 by 7 this evening upper 40s with mainly clear skies for us but dry conditions notice the dry weather through the central united states we're going to deal with that uh, for the next 24 hours or so our next frontal boundary right now is over the northwest united states that's coming through thursday night so again looking at clearing skies into the afternoon hours with clear skies through tonight as well maybe a few passing clouds tomorrow morning but generally thursday mainly sunny into thursday night that frontal boundary starts to approach evidence of that with the cloud cover north of the lake before midnight. The front will quickly pass through on the south shore just after midnight, maybe squeezing out a few showers, but no major storms that we're concerned with. That front is offshore by sunrise Friday. We're back to sunshine, but cooler air coming in behind that front. 50s today, that patchy fog. Again, we could see that through around 8, 9 o'clock this morning. Chilly afternoon, well below average. 35 to 45 tonight and more fog potential as we watch those winds start coming in from the southwest overnight, 5 to 10 miles per hour. For the Saints game on Sunday, not looking too bad. We have a late day kickoff, 540, so temperatures will be around 54 degrees. I have a chance for a few showers into evening with temperatures in the upper 40s. That's with a weak disturbance that will be moving through. Monday, MLK Day, we're back to 62 degrees, dry conditions, mainly sunny skies, and then Tuesday, I think, begins the start of what's going to be a wet pattern into midweek with another disturbance. Right now, I have high temperatures in the upper 60s and rain chances at 30%.